Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are using WooCommerce and your order emails are not going out, then don't be panic. In this video, I will walk you through the top reasons why emails fail to send in a WooCommerce and how you can fix them step by step. First of all, let's check if WooCommerce is even trying to send emails. Then for this, go to the WooCommerce and then click on settings. Then right from there, click on the emails. Then here please make sure that the emails are enabled, especially the new order. Click here to check whether it's enabled or not. So if it is not enabled, then you have to enable this in order to process your emails. So currently it's enabled, so let's move forward. So now let's confirm if your WordPress site is capable of sending any emails. By default, WordPress uses the PHP mail function, but this is unreliable on many hosts. So to test this, install a plugin like WP Mail SMTP. Right, WP Mail SMTP. Here is the plugin. Install this. Then activate it. You can see here that the WP Mail SMTP plugin has been activated. Then go to settings. So in order to test the email, you have to go to the tools. So now enter here the email address where the test email will be sent and then click on the send email. If you are able to receive the email, then it's perfect. But if you are not able to receive the email, then it means that something is wrong. So if emails are not going out, it's time to switch to SMTP. This is the more reliable way to send emails. So this is basically the WP mail SMTP setting page. And here you can see that WordPress uses the PHP mail function. But this is unreliable on many hosts. So it's time to switch to the Google Gmail because uh, it's too reliable. Uh, your uh, mail will not be uh, going uh, into the spam. So just scroll down and here you are seeing that you know, we have the client ID and the client secret key. So uh, you need to get this. So if you don't know how to set up the uh, WP mail SMTP uh, plugin with the Gmail, then uh, I have added the link of the video tutorial uh, in the description. Uh, I already made the video on this, so you just go ahead and uh, watch this tutorial in order to uh, get the client ID and the client secret key. So as I already have the client ID and the client secret, so I'm not going to do that stuff. So I'm just going to paste. So I have pasted the client ID and the client secrets. The next step that I will do is save settings. And here you will be able to see the success message. Settings were successfully saved. Now in order to test it, you can go again to the tools section and here you can make a test email. So that's it. Fixing WooCommerce email issues can seem frustrating, but once SMTP is set up, things run much smoother. So if this video helped you, be sure to like, subscribe and leave a comment below. If you are still facing issues, we reply to everyone.